Hey guys, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a holiday inspired look with mostly drugstore products. I have a few high ends in there, but not that many. So if you want to see how I got this gorgeous green eyeshadow and super red lip for the holidays, keep watching. So to start off this holiday look, I'm going to be taking my Clinique Pep Start Cleansing Wipes just to wipe off everything else that I have left over on my face from last night. Next, I am taking my Ride or Die Primer, the Smashbox Photo Finish. I'm going to be applying that in my T-zone. Now, just for that extra step, um, I'm going to be taking the Urban Decay Quick Fix and just spraying this on my face. While that dries, I take my Kat Von D High Voltage Eye Primer and just put that on my lids. Okay. Now moving on, I have been doing this strange thing where I have been putting my concealer under my foundation and that seems to work pretty decently for me just because I have a lot of red like acne scars and just blemishes that you can still see through my foundation. Um, I am going in with the Catrice Liquid Camouflage Concealer. And I'm just going to be blending that in with a damp beauty blender. Now I'll be going in with my all-time favorite foundation, the Fenty Beauty. Now I just squirt this on the back of my hand, put it on the bottom of the beauty blender, and then put it all on my face. Now to make sure that this is all blended in, I do go in with a Real Techniques technique brush and just kind of buff the rest in. Alright, now once that is complete, I do go in with um, a setting powder. And I do just use my Beauty Blender just so I put it under my... Um, under my eyes and then in my smile lines. I do use um, the air spun. Now while that is sitting, I am gonna go in with my Carly Bible um, BH Cosmetics and start working on my eyes. First thing I do is take a big flush fluffy brush. This is the um, double sided brush that came with the Naked 3 palette. Um, and excuse the condition of this palette. I, it's my everyday palette. So I am going to be taking the lightest shade here and putting it all over uh, my eyes. Next, I'm going to take a smaller brush. Um, this is just a blending brush, but from e.l.f. And I'm taking the kind of next darkest shade over here. And just going to use that to darken my crease just a little bit. Next thing I'm going to do, this is a more new product that I have found from Rite Aid. It is by the brand Jessie's Girl. These things are $4.99. Um, it's a fluid eyeshadow. So it comes in like this little, probably shouldn't dump over. Um, it's like a little, you know, like liquid eyeliner brush. Um, I am going to go put, put this all over my lids. This does stay kind of wet, I have noticed from my practice trial, um, so you do have to be careful. These also don't have um, shade names, 
It does. This is called Enchanted Forest. So now while that dries um, until we do the second coat, I am going to go ahead and move on with my makeup. Okay, so I'm going to brush off my bake now. Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take a lip scrub. This is by the brand Bite. Now I'm going in with my bronzer. This is the Sephora uh, Las Cablos. This is one of my all-time favorite bronzers. I'm just going to take a little small angled brush. This is a wet and wild brush. Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take my highlighter. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Nicole Guerrero. And I'm probably going to take the shade Forever Lit. As you can tell, these two are my absolute favorite. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with the Forever Lit. This is just another Real Techniques brush. Just gonna blend that in a tiny bit so I'm not super shiny. All right, my eyes are dry, so I'm gonna go ahead and put another layer of the Jessie's Girl on. All right, and while that dries, I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows now. Um, I'm going to go in, of course, with the Anastasia Brow Wiz. Now I'm going to take the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel and just kind of run this through, make sure all my brow hairs stay in place. Alright, so now that that's done, I am going to go ahead and finish my eyes. I'm going to do a layer of liquid eyeliner and throw on some mascara. The mascara I have been absolutely obsessed with has been this Essence Lash Princess. This is only a couple of bucks at um, Ulta, and it is so good, you'll see in a minute. And then, of course, I just use my trusty e.l.f. liquid eyeliner. Okay, so I also threw on some pencil liner in my waterline. I don't typically do that anymore, but I do have this um, gel eye pencil by the brand um, Essence that almost matches perfectly to my liquid um, Jessie's Girl eyeshadow, and it's in the shade Urban Jungle, and once again, um, got this from Ulta, I want to say it was like 93 cents or something ridiculously cheap, and it's waterproof, and it's one of the creamiest eyeliners that I've gotten to use in a while, so threw that in my waterline. And last but not least, I am going to go put on this super red liquid lipstick. This is the, by the brand Wet n Wild. The only one complaint that I have about this particular lipstick is that it is a little bit runny, so you have to be extremely careful when you apply it. Alright you guys, this is my finished holiday makeup look. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I should be posting new videos coming soon. I'm finally getting getting a new camera so I won't have to record on my phone anymore. But like I said, don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and see you soon. Bye!